Hi, it's Jan Howell here with another DIY tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make these tissue paper blossoms. It's a quick and simple craft project that I think you're really going to love. Let's get started. You'll only need a few items to make your tissue blossoms. Of course you'll need some tissue paper. You can use different shades of pink or you can even use white. Whatever color of blossoms you want to be on your branches. A pair of scissors, a glue gun, and glue. And if you don't have a glue gun you can, you can just use Elmer's glue. It's just a glue gun does work a lot quicker. Go out in your yard and find some long skinny branches. And you'll need about maybe four or five branches per bouquet, depending on what you're doing with them. And I like to just put my branches in a mason jar. You can, of course, just use a vase. And a pair of pruners will come in handy for cutting your branches. So I have cut my tissue paper in two inch strips. I'm going to fold one of the strips in half. That will help make the process go a little quicker. And on this fold, we're just going to be cutting scallops on one side of the tissue paper. So on this folded edge, I'm just going to cut half of a scallop. Now they don't have to be perfect by any means. I'm cutting down about three quarters of the strip. And I'm going to cut them about every five flowers. One, two, three, four, five. And while these are still stacked with several layers, I'm going to curl the blossoms. So to curl the petals, just take your scissors closed and just like you curl ribbon, hold your thumb just gently while you pull out and that will curl. It's pretty cool. And I'm doing several layers at a time. And you'll just be working with one layer at a time. And all you're going to do is just cinch up the bottom edges, kind of rolling it. Like that. And then just take the bottom and just kind of twist it. Kind of fluff it out. And there you have one of the blossoms. And you're just going to make as many as you want to put on your branches. So pretty simple. And what's crazy is they really just look so much like a, a real blossom. These beautiful pink flowers. Now we're just going to hot glue them to our branches. Find places where you want to glue them. Add a little dab of hot glue and grab a blossom and just stick it to the branch. So once you have your blossoms all glued on to your branches, grab your mason jar or your vase and just stick them in. I've cut the branches at a good length and I'm going to put about five branches in the jar. Aren't they just lovely sitting on your cupboard or your table? Such a fun happy little decoration to have in your house. They almost look real. There's a fun, easy craft project for you. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, make sure you do that. Click on the bell so you can be notified when I put something new up. 
We'll see you next time.